Hello everyone. I wanted to point out a major issue I found with Filmora 9. I'm not an expert video editor, but it only took me five minutes to find this major flaw that stopped me in my tracks and made me revert back to Filmora 8. I can't believe more people are not bringing this up in their reviews, so I thought I'd just do this as a one-off. Let's get started. I'm going to drag this clip here to the timeline. First, I wanted to look at adjusting the length and or speed of a video clip. Sometimes I need a clip to last a specific amount of time without having to cut or clip it. Adjusting the playback speed can help to do that, especially if it's just a minor adjustment. Filmora has fallen flat on their face on this one and no one has seemed to call them out. We can see here by the timeline that the clip is about 18 seconds right now. Also, we can see if we right click on the clip within the timeline, we can go to speed and duration. And you can see also here that the duration implies that the clip is 18 seconds. So it acknowledges that. This is correct. Also, when you go to adjust and drag the length of the video, for some reason it says the duration is now 21 seconds, almost 22 seconds. We just saw that it was 18 seconds. Then when you adjust it, you can never tell what the true reduction or duration is while you're dragging it. This is a major glitch. Alright, let's go back to the speed and duration menu. So what I like to do is adjust a numerical value within this menu so that I can get the clip to fit the specific length that I want it to be without having to guess the speed factor. Alright, so let's reduce this 18 second clip in half. Let's make it, let's just do nine seconds. Oh, okay. I was expecting it to only shrink it by like half the distance in the timeline. What did it do? That is not what I asked it to do. Anyone watching this can tell you that this is not how it's supposed to work. 0 0.08? I didn't even type the number 8. Multiplied it by 67, almost 68 times the speed that it originally was. I really only should have been doubling the speed. So this is just one thing that has prevented me from moving forward with this. It seems like they have a lot of great features, but this is a real deal breaker. I can't get past this part to get to the more detailed, uh, granular, advanced features that they added. I hope they fix it soon.